Hi everyone, thanks for visiting the channel. Here's my 2016 YZ250 with a newly installed pipe from Lex. Now I think the pipe looks great, and so far the performance has been really good. I could really only think of three reasons as to why somebody would buy a new pipe for their bike. Probably because they smashed their old pipe and need a replacement, or maybe they're just looking for a pipe that will enhance their performance at some different point in the power band, or maybe they're just looking to change the look of their bike. And I suppose if you're like a serious racer, um, you might be buying a different pipe to reduce weight. Installation was a breeze. It's just really a matter of unbolting the old exhaust and replacing it with the new. You'll see me whip through the process here while I just kind of talk a bit more about the pipe. Now, while you could certainly use this Lex pipe on the motocross track, I think its intended audience is really for those weekend warrior trail riders like me. Uh, you're getting a pipe made of 18 gauge steel, which is thicker than the steel used in the stock pipe. And this means it really won't dent as easily, but it also means it's gonna be a little bit heavier. This pipe is also supposed to free up a little bit of low to mid-range power, but honestly, I can't really tell the difference. I bought this pipe mainly because I like the look of the polished nickel plating, but I also wanted a pipe with thicker steel that wouldn't change the power delivery much on my bike. The closest option on the market would be the FMF Gnarly pipe, which is also made of 18 gauge steel with some thinner 19 gauge sections. Remember, as the number goes up, the steel gets thinner. The Gnarly pipe is designed to boost low end torque and it costs around $270, which is about $70 more than the Lex. The Lex pipe is manufactured in China, which may be the reason it could be offered at a lower price point. Thanks for watching the video. If you're into dirt bikes, check out the other videos on my channel. Thanks for watching, everyone.